So we are here with a cool sculpting patient, and I can't say it better than you have. Thank you very much for sharing. Well, it was the greatest thing I ever did to have cool sculpting on my neck. It was a complete metamorphosis. I mean, I, my, I feel so much better. My neck looks so much better, all areas of my neck. And um, I, it's the best thing I've ever done for myself. And it was completely pain-free. So that, I mean, it's almost hard to believe it's the best thing you've ever done. Tell me, I mean, I'm so glad. Well, I, <laughs> I don't mean to have sounds, but tell me how. Well, it's just given me a renewed confidence. Um, at my age, I'm feeling just fantastic. It makes me want to take better care of myself all the way around. In fact, I came in today and got dermaplaning and it was amazing. And, um, and so it just, um, it gives me a belief in myself that, um, I can pretty much get out there and do anything. And that just all of that, because my neck looks better. <laughs> What was the moment when you decided you wanted to do something about your neck? Well, we were at a family outing, and um, someone took a picture of me. Um, it was a profile picture, and I my hair was shorter, um, and oh my goodness, I saw it. They She texted it to me, and I was like, delete immediately. It, it was just like... It was horrible. I just couldn't believe it. I mean, because when you look in the mirror, I think you sort of see what you want to see. And that picture made me see what was there. And I was like, I have to do something. And um, I, I knew about uh, you and I knew about cool sculpting. And I knew that, that this is where I wanted to come and do it. Well, that's awesome. Yeah. So you told me something your husband said. Which... Mm -hmm. He was like, are you letting your hair grow? You just look different. And I was like, yep, yeah, that's it. I'm letting my hair grow. <laughs> Yeah, they're so oh. smart. Mm -hmm. So observant. Yes. So tell me um, what the, it's hard to believe that the best thing you ever did was cool sculpt your <laughs> neck, but it wasn't necessarily about your neck. And that's the part mm -mm. that's hard to put into words. It is. I mean, it's the best thing I've ever done for me. You know, when you're a mom and you're raising kids and, and you, you, you always put yourself on the back burner. And I thought when our kids went off to college that I would start to take care of me. Well, they went off to college and then I found other people to take care of and my husband and you just get in the habit of putting yourself on the back burner. And when I saw that picture that day, I was like, you're, you're done putting yourself on the back burner. And it was, I came in and had it done and it was just like it turned my whole self around. Because you did something for yourself. And then you felt since then you've been doing other things for yourself. Right. Okay. You know, I've, I'm watching more what I eat and I'm not looking at it as a chore. I'm looking at it as an improvement to myself. And all of that, it, it, that one picture and then coming in and having the cool sculpting and seeing the results completely changed the way I looked at myself and gave me a, just a whole new outlook. And I couldn't be happier. So tell me how, like, when you saw that picture, and we're going to post it for y'all, but tell me how you felt. I was, I, is there a word past elated? Because I just, I couldn't believe it. It was, I will tell you this, it's, you know, you get to a point where you don't want to look at yourself in the mirror, and I couldn't stop looking at the picture. <laughs> I was like, I can't believe that's my profile. And um, I'm going to go home, and I'm going to find where I trashed that picture, in my phone and I'm going to look at it again and compare it because <laughs> it's amazing. You feel happier, lighter? Yeah, everything about me is better. My whole countenance is different. What's but countenance? My, every, my everything that people see about me, the way I carry myself, um, really the way I think, you know, I pretty much find myself seeing the glass half full now instead of having a negative outlook and um, all of that because I'm really grateful for how my neck looks and it just turned everything around it's crazy how you see something and it bothers you and it's people some people say oh that's vain to fix it but you think about yourself less when it's in some ways right and I, I'm a firm believer that um, well my father always said my father works in the clothing industry and he said if you look good you feel good and and that goes past clothing you know um I carry myself differently. I'm wearing my hair differently now because of it, where more of me is exposed rather than um, than trying to cover it up like I used to grow my hair out and do. And and so now I'm just, I'm happy with who I see in the mirror, 100%. That's awesome. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> it is It is amazing what all the things you find that you do different when you, when you feel good. You look, I mean, you look good, you feel good, mm -hmm. and it's, 
it's really the neck is like the most minimal part. And right. Right. Yeah. I mean, that's that's what I see when I look in the mirror. Um, but it goes past that. Um, it just filters into every aspect of my life in terms of how I see myself, how I relate with people, um, how I relate with my students. I'm a teacher. Everything. So what are some things that you did to try to hide your neck? Your well, hair? the wet my hair, the clothes I would wear. Um, I wore a lot of scarves up to here. <laughs> Um, I wore, um, a lot of collars turned up. Um, and I'll, I'll tell you, I'm a golfer and on the golf course in the summer, in the heat, you just can't do that. And I would find myself not thinking about the fun I was having out on a beautiful golf course, but are these people looking at me? And, um, and that's going to go away now. And, um, and I'm so excited, you know, I'm so happy about it. And so you've done other things for yourself. You're taking care of yourself, mm -hmm. working on exercise, mm -hmm. and eating healthy. My diet, yeah. And you had a dermal plane. Mm -hmm. And next time, I, when I come back, I'm going to do the hydrofacial because um, I cannot wait. Um, it sounds so amazing, and that's going to happen. So it's not just that you're doing things, and I know you enjoyed the dermal plane. Mm -hmm. It's that you're taking the time for yourself. Right. I'm thinking about me. And, and it just, you know, this sort of... Um, sort of spearheaded me realizing that taking better care of me and feeling better about me actually helps me take better care of other people. You know, I'm a better mom, I'm a better wife, I'm a, now I'm a better grandma. So, yeah. Tell me how. Will you give me one example? Well, yeah. For example, when I go out with my husband, we go to a lot of corporate affairs. And when I go out with him now, since having, you know, the cool sculpting done, I just hold myself differently. I have more confidence. I don't shy away. I used to find myself, um, my husband's taller than me and I would find myself hiding behind him partly, you know, and that go that's gone away now. And even, um, I'm more bold with my clothing choices, you know, I'm wearing brighter colors and, and, um, and just everything. It's just better all the way around. My whole life is more enhanced just by doing that one thing for me. That makes me so happy. Well, makes me really happy too. Thank and you so much for sharing. My pleasure. Any advice to anybody? Come get some cool sculpting because boy, <laughs> it will change your life. <laughs> all right. Y'all have a great day.